Hi everyone, myself Dr. Deepak Gowda. I am a consultant cardiothoracic surgeon at Sakra World Hospital. So today I will be throwing some light on heart transplantation. So heart transplantation is a surgery wherein we remove a diseased heart from the recipient and replace it with a healthy donor heart from a clinically dead person who is called as a brain dead donor. So who gets a heart transplant and who donates a heart? So heart obviously is from a brain dead donor who is clinically dead, who has been declared dead clinically so who receives a heart so anyone who is in end stage heart failure what we call as a stage d heart failure who cannot be managed medically with optimum medications ends up in getting a heart transplantation so what are the symptoms of the heart failure so the patients basically present with breathing difficulty gaining more weight recent increase in weight and lack of hunger as they had previously so these individuals uh, are initially managed with uh, medications and when all these medications fail and the symptoms are not relieved, they end up in getting a heart transplantation. So what are the causes of the heart failure? So in kids especially, the most common cause is because of the inborn uh, congenital heart defects. In adults, most common cause across the globe is ischemic cardiomyopathy, what we call post myocardial infarction, post heart attack. So these patients uh, have the weakening of their heart muscles and this leads to heart failure. Other causes are uh, abnormal heart rhythm and previous failed heart transplantation and other causes like hypertension, smoking, all this leads to heart failure over a period of time. So after the heart transplantation, now with the latest development and uh, improvements in the uh, immunosuppression therapy, the average survival is more than 15 years of age. So how do you prevent from uh, not getting a heart failure? So main thing is smoking. So you should stop smoking. Smoking is the biggest enemy of the heart. So healthy food habits is another important aspect and excessive uh, exercise, uh, healthy exercises for the heart is encouraged. If you are a diabetic or a hypertensive, uh, hypertensive you need to have your diabetes or hypertension on control mm -hmm.